Hey, do you know any magic words? Abracadabra is a magic word. And there are more magic words, like please and thank you. When you say those magic words, they let people know that you have good manners. <laughs> I know someone who has super good manners. Our pal Max. Let's see what he's up to today. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and now it's time for Good Manners with Max. Today we learn the importance of saying excuse me. Hi, my name is Max, and this is my dog, Banjo. Say hi, Banjo. Bark! Lately, I've been thinking about two little words that really help you use your good manners, and those words are, excuse me. Um, the other day, I wanted to ask my mom something right away, and it really couldn't wait, but she was talking on the phone to a friend, and there wasn't a break in the talking, so I said, excuse me, can I ask just one thing? And my mom said, certainly, dear. And once, when I was at the school cafeteria, I stepped in front of someone in line by mistake, and when I realized what happened, I said, oops, excuse me, and I went to the back of the line to wait my turn. Um, those two little words work very well together, and it's important to use them when you, um, bump into someone by mistake, or reach in front of your sister at the dinner table, or if you have something to tell your mom while she's busy. Excuse me. Yes, what is it, Max? Um, Timmy's on the phone, and he wants me to come over and play. Certainly. Good manners matter because good manners show you care about people. Whoa. Saying excuse, excuse me is one way to show good manners. For more good manners with Max, grab a grown-up and go to PlayhouseDisney.com. Um, bye. Bark. <laughs>